It's officially 2024. I can't really scream because it's um, 1 a.m. right now. <laughs> um, hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to a brand new year, brand new James Standard Time. Well, not really brand new James Standard Time, but new year, yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, as I said, it's 1 a.m. right now. I don't want to scream too loud because um, it is nighttime. And yes, it's been an hour since the countdown, so I'm pretty sure people are asleep now. But anyway, <laughs> I didn't start my vlog where I usually start it on a Sunday because you know what? I might as well start it on the 1st of January. I think that's a really good idea. So welcome to brand new year. <laughs> um, I didn't really make any plans. Um, I wasn't actually in the mood to make any plans. I actually wanted to be alone. <laughs> Before anyone says, oh, it's sad, oh, James, you know, friends, I actually chose to. <laughs> I had uh, two groups of friends invite me to a party or like a little gathering. Even the small gathering, I was really iffy about. I was like, you know what, I'm good, guys. I think I'm just gonna chill at home. <laughs> and you know what I did? I got some food delivered, I had <laughs> some not not non alcoholic beverages. I watched a K drama. I watched a movie. I haven't played games yet, surprisingly, and then edited the vlog. My last look of 2023. It's up now, and here I am. I just, if you saw earlier, I was actually wiping a new chair right here. Um, it's not new. It's actually a new old chair. Basically, I got this chair from my mom because in her office. They all got brand new chairs and all these chairs were actually gonna get thrown out. But they're all still pretty like good condition. The only thing that was nasty about these um, new chairs was the wheels. Like I thought it was gonna be dirt and stuff, but there was like dust bunnies knotted into it. I was like wiping it and I'm like, oh, this is disgusting. So I had to cut and then pull out strands of dust bunnies, hair. And then one of them I couldn't get completely. It had yarn? or something green yarn and it was tangled like crazy. I cut out as much as I can and pulled it out, but there's still some remnants, but it's better than it was before, but it was nasty, the wheels. The surface of the chair is fine, which I'm guessing makes sense because people sit on it and they wipe it down regularly, but they don't care about the wheels. So, yeah. Because the reason why I wanted a new chair is because the one I'm sitting in, for A, it squeaks a lot. <laughs> it's extremely old. But I haven't thrown it away because I don't have any other chairs. Because you know, uh, in my room, I use a dining room ta uh, t a table chair. So it, you know, it works, but <laughs> it's not the best. So I'm not going to throw away this nasty chair yet. I'm going to use it for my room. But now I have the new one here, which I'll use for playing video games on my TV and my PC, which you can't see. But yeah. Um... I'm probably going to go to bed soon because I'm still trying to sleep early and keep that up. So, nothing much going to happen, but I will see you guys in about 8 hours, 8 to 9 hours. But to you guys, it will probably be like literally 2 seconds. Um, New Year's resolutions. I don't know what I'm going to... I don't have really things in mind. I, when it comes to New Year's resolutions, I try to keep it very simple and very easy to accomplish. If you set yourself up for a very difficult New Year's resolution, believe it or not, I'm sorry, believe it or not, you're probably going to drop that resolution by the end of this week. So I want to do something that's possible. And one thing that I've, I'm going to try to really do is definitely save money again. I saved a lot of money last year when it came to... Um, looking carefully at my paycheck but at the same time I had a goal because I want to go to Korea so I'm gonna travel again this year right to Korea and Hong Kong again move Japan this time so I need to save money again which will allow me to save up because at the end of the day on my trip I didn't actually use all the money that I saved up I what I predicted I would use this much but I, I didn't even use half so good on me and the other half I just ended up saving so <laughs> I don't have to save as much this time to go to Korea which is a good thing other thing is, I'm going to see if I can keep my sleeping pattern well, keep it going. And then, of course, um, not get in shape, but, you know, make sure I am taking care of myself a little better this year. Like, I know people are going to be like, I'm going to lose this weight, I'm going to go to the gym every day, and blah, blah, blah. That, that, that is kind of obtainable if you have the drive. So let's be honest, I don't have that drive. So <laughs> I'm going to set a simpler one, is just keep healthy. I'm going to keep going on walks. I'm gonna maintain my diet properly, not really a diet, but my fasting times a little better. Um, 
and maybe do a little bit more of a workout, maybe turn my walks into little jogs or runs. Because, you know, I'm not gonna be going to the gym anytime soon to do that crazy stuff, but I wanna continue to do the cardio, because I don't mind doing cardio. I don't mind doing little workouts at home, but I'm gonna keep it more intense, and my diet, and then progressively get better and better. Because I'm not gonna say, I'm gonna lose a bajillion pounds, I'm gonna do a workout, gain muscle. I'm like, to me, that is a little, like, unattainable for me. Some people can do it, I can't, because, you know, I'm lazy. But yeah, I don't know, saving money, sleeping, healthy. Um, I don't think I can think of anything else. If I think of anything else after I wake up, then of course I'll forget it. I don't think of anything else, but yeah. Hopefully 2024 is going to be a good one. We shall see. <laughs> Okay, so the mini fridge I ordered on Boxing Day because it was on sale arrived. It said it's supposed to come on Friday, but it came earlier. Not gonna complain. I got a really good deal on this one. Um, it's not a brand I know, but honestly, it's just a mini fridge. Who cares? You know, the deal I got, it really doesn't matter. I know people are loyal to certain brands when they buy stuff, but I'm loyal to an extent. <laughs> Like a mini fridge isn't that important to me, so that's why I like what doesn't care about the brand. The price matters this time. Uh, now styrofoam. I hate dealing with styrofoam. Okay. I got it out. I got it. I don't want to break the styrofoam because it'll be a bitch to clean. There you go. That was in the garbage. Oh, there's a handle. Wow, they, it is very light. Wow, does it work? <laughs> it has a handle, I didn't know that. Ta -da! Uh, once I get it up and running, I'll show you guys again. Kumi's on round one, two, three of Robin. Crazy, crazy. He eats it like it's nothing. Look at that, it's round three now. <laughs> I don't think he has enough broth at this point. <laughs> no, I'm sweating so much. Oh, he's eating spicy meat, so that's why he's sweating. Takumi's on number four now. He's on number four. And he's still going. He says he might stop because he feels bad for the staff, but I'm like, no, go ahead. And there's just this one waiting. <laughs> oh, Takumi. <laughs> Where does it all go? <laughs> It's the first day off of a new month in a new year, technically. <laughs> and we all know that means I'm gonna clean half my apartment from top to bottom. Because if I do the whole apartment, I waste my day off and, you know, I get really agitated very easily because <laughs> I don't have a day of rest. It's just, or it's just me being in diva. Anyway, uh, today's goal was the bathroom. I uh, just did some laundry, drying my pants over here. I didn't really show you my mini fridge. Now, don't get used to it being here. I just used this position here to test it out to make sure it works. And I must say, it's. I was a little disappointed at the beginning, but I'm okay with it now. Basically, first off, the big problem I don't I have with it is that it's kind of noisy. You can hear the fan going all the time, but it's not a big deal. For example, if I'm playing video games or watching TV or doing something, I don't really notice the sound. And it doesn't bother me when I sleep because it's in this room. My only other gripe with this is that the cooling. Now this fridge has the function to actually heat up things too, but it has the cooling function. Now the cooling function doesn't actually do a good job when it comes to taking something that's warm or normal to room temperature and making it cold. But it is good when I take something that's already super cold, like from the fridge and put in here, it will remain pretty cold because for some reason, even though it's like there's ice here right now, it's really cold to the touch here. The things in the fridge aren't that cold. At first I thought because I put my lemon tea in bad spots and it's blocking the fan, but it's basically, it's just the back half is really cold. So my lemon tea that's inside deep is really cold. The ones that are out here are not because this is blocking it. So that's another flaw I can't 
really like, but if I put something that's already cold in here, it actually stays cold and helps the fridge out. So, you know, that's not a bad thing. Everything in here is chilled. Not cold, but chilled, because I put all this lemon tea in here when it was like room temperature. So in the future, I might just adapt and put like chilled things in there already so that it becomes cold. But yeah, um, I think my plan is to, um, when I move my air conditioning system here away, I'll put like a small table and put the fridge on top. And then on that same table, I'll put snacks and stuff. So it'll be like a snack corner, which I think is a good idea. So in the long run, I'll give this probably like a six or seven out of 10. Um, but basically if I don't need it or don't have a lot of drinks, I'll probably unplug it. Cause you know, might as well save some power. All right, so the goal today is to clean the kitchen and the bathroom. It's not too bad. I just have a few dishes and bathroom's always the same. Yeah, and then I think, I have three days off in a row. She got my hair. <laughs> I woke up with the hair spit like that. I'm like, you know what, I don't that bad. <laughs> that bad, guys. And if you're wondering why I don't do my hair normally like this, it's because it's random. <laughs> so yeah, don't get used to it. Um, so I'm gonna clean the bathroom and just take it easy. Tomorrow, I'm gonna hang out with my mom, because I think I mentioned she wanted to go to the outlet malls that's like really far away, but she doesn't want to go by herself because she's scared she'll get lost. And I haven't been there in a long time, so I'll go with her. And then I think after that, tomorrow, I will come back and do the rest of my apartment. And then Sunday is completely to myself. And then Monday, I'm doing a half day kind of situation. But I'll explain that, that's next week, so we won't worry about that. In fact, Sunday's next week too, so yeah, anyway. I'm gonna start cleaning. majority of the day um, just cleaning the rest of my apartment because yesterday I cleaned my bathroom and kitchen today was just the living room and my bedroom changed my bed sheets and everything super clean and I'm ready for the rest of the month um, next month's big apartment cleanup is gonna be very very thorough because it is gonna be Chinese New Year one um, Chinese New Year's I think on the 10th so the first week of February when I do do my clean, it's gonna be pretty, pretty thorough. I could wait another week, but knowing me procrastinating it might not be a good idea. But yeah, and earlier today, as you saw, I went to um, uh, the Japanese market, a new one. They opened Daruma, another one, a really big one. And I was actually pleasantly surprised. I thought it would be kind of small, but it was actually pretty big. Because the one close to my house is actually very small. But this one was really, really good. It's all the way down to Wasson Mills. I want my mom because my mom actually has never been to Tawasa Mills. It's been open for like five years or so right now and <laughs> she hasn't been and the thing is it's not that far from where we live but she's always felt it daunting. I don't like going down there because it's not that impressive of a mall. It's just a big mall but there's a lot of stores that are just not what you need basically so we don't there was no reason for me to go down there and also Believe it or not, there are no signs. When you're driving down there, I've noticed, if I didn't use Google Maps, I would've gotten lost because there were no signs that said Tawasin Mills or Ball this way. Whereas everywhere else I've been, there's always a bit of a, a late road sign saying, hey, this mall's coming up or this attraction's coming up. Not for that mall, it's really weird. 
But anyway, I also realized today that when I vlog, if I forget my camera at home, like I did today, I tend to give up vlogging for the day and I always end up with not having enough footage. But then today, like this year in general, I felt to myself as a new year resolution, if I don't have my camera, it shouldn't be an excuse to not vlog. I have a phone. <laughs> I have to be more creative with filming with my camera, uh, with my phone, because it's a little different format. Like I could easily just flip it horizontal and film like that. But how do I put this? Vlogging? on a cell phone horizontally is very awkward to hold unless I have a selfie stick, which I don't. <laughs> or like one of those clamps. So it didn't work really well, so that's why I always didn't want to do it because my case isn't really easy to hold, if you know what I mean. So <laughs> that's why I also did vlog. So today I'm like, you know what, screw it. My editing has improved. I'll keep it the vertical way, but I'll just, you know, edit out the sides, whatever. At least I have footage. And I think I actually like it that way, doing the vertical, because again, yeah, that way you guys can tell I'm filming on my phone. And then it also allows me to have more footage when I don't bring my camera by accident. So yeah, so expect to see that kind of footage from now on. Anyway, I'll show you guys what I got. I didn't actually buy anything else at Tawasa Mills, because a lot of the stores, it's supposed to be an outlet, and a lot of the sales were kind of just mid, nothing too crazy. But I did buy some treats at the Daruma there. <laughs> I bought some Japanese chocolate chip cookies. If you've never had Japanese chocolate chip cookies, you're missing out. They're always really, really good. <laughs> and then, <laughs> my mom grabbed a few things for my nephew, and then I grabbed this Pokemon cookie treat thing. It looked really cool. It's the new generation of Pokemon, because it's the Captain Pikachu. I still haven't watched a new episode of Pokemon yet. I've, and Adorama also has all the convenience store bakery goods from 7-Eleven, but I didn't buy any of it. I did pick up two juice boxes from 7-Eleven, the convenience store ones, and apple juice and orange juice. <laughs> and then finally, this caught my eye. Well, two of these things caught my eye. I grab a Pokemon gummy. Um, has flavors, I think lemon, soda pop, and grape. There was another pack above this one, but it had a picture of a Pikachu holding a toothbrush. And as I touched the packet, it, it was gummies again. But I wasn't sure, like, was it dental candy? I wasn't sure. I took a picture for Takumi, and he didn't really translate it. He just says candy. But, but what does it mean with the toothbrush, though? I think it has something to do with dental. I don't know. I, might, I only bought these things. But yeah. As I said, I came home clean, and then I had dinner with my mom, and then, yeah, I'm just relaxing right now. But I'm probably going to call it a night, because I woke up pretty early today. I didn't sleep very well, so I'm probably just going to head to the bathroom, do my skincare routine, and head to bed. But, so I think I'll end my vlog here. So, I guess I'll see you all next week. Oh, did I was No, I think we're good. Okay, I'll see you guys next week. Bye.